Parts from home, 60 minutes under your belt. How are you feeling? Uh, for, yeah, I feel all right. It feels good to be obviously back involved uh, in, a, in a proper game. I've, I've been training for the last couple of weeks, so it was nice to finally obviously step onto a pitch and have a bit of a game. Um, like obviously, I've been out for so long that I know I was just just about long enough for me to be out there today. But it was nice to be back. A little bit of rust, but uh, hopefully not too long until I'll be all right. What is the stage now? Is it just a case of building that fitness up? Is it everything's okay with the injury um, itself? Yeah, if, if touch wood, everything's fine. Um, I, I went through periods where I, I thought I was going to be back training. And I, like I was outside doing my stuff, getting fit again. Um, and had a couple of problems. I had um, two infections that I have dealt with. So I, I, I had um, I've, in in total I've had five operations on on one broken leg. So it's been like it's been been a bit tough. But um, and there's been times where I've thought I was almost back in training and felt like I was flying and then I'm back in hospital the day after so uh, it's nice now to finally to, to feel like almost I'm, I'm completely getting over it um, I'm training every day and, and, and I feel good so uh, I've got to keep on top of my, like keep on top of my fitness obviously and, and, and stay with the physio, physios after after training and stuff but I'm all, like I feel like I'm almost there yeah you feel you say you're almost there, but still a long way to go as well from uh, getting yeah. yourself back involved in and around that first team. Yeah, definitely. I've, the standard is so high, and, and obviously, I've, like I've, I feel like I'm just coming back into it. This training's different to, to playing a game, so obviously you, you do, do what you can do in training. I feel like I'm going to do my best every single day to to better myself and and to improve. And and obviously, when you when you step into a game environment, it's a lot different, and and it's going to take time to build up that sort of match. Fitness, tempo, and, and all the rest of it. I'm, I'm sure everybody who's, pl- who's played obviously would know uh, what I mean. Um, but for the time being, obviously, like I'm, I'm happy obviously to be involved. It's been so long, and you know, I've had some, some obviously some, some massive lows. But to now, obviously, to be involved and, and to be around it, it, it feels quite good. How low have you been at times? If you could put oh. it into words and describe it. Um, <sighs> um, almost low enough to, to think about stopping. Um, if I'm honest, um, at the end, like the end of the season, everybody was on such a massive buzz round here um, that I was like, I, obviously, I was forgotten about. But I was like, I was sat in bed watching everybody celebrate, and I had my leg in a cast. People like, I, I've obviously had like, I felt like I got fit again. I had my first infection, um, which I had three operations on in a week. So I spent a week in hospital, and the the, the surgeon told me potentially if if they hadn't have caught it when they caught it. Potentially, the infection could have harmed the bone, put enough damage on it to, to stop obviously me playing. So um, that took me breath a, a, a little bit, but obviously I, f- I feel blessed now that that I'm back involved and um, I've, I just like the most, obviously to, to make the most of of the time I've got available now to, to play and, and enjoy playing. I've like I'm massively enjoying myself now. I'll go out with a smile on my face every day because I feel um, obviously blessed that I'm able to be out there. So. Have you spoken to Eddie how much? Is he had much to say about where he wants you to go next and, and you getting yourself back in and around the um, first team? Yeah, the gaffer's been great to me. I can't thank the gaffer enough. Just, just um, obviously, like he's been great to me in training, um, talking to me, making sure I'm, I feel okay, making sure I'm getting the right uh, attention and treatment off the pitch as well as on the pitch. Um, I, like I, I feel completely comfortable that. You know the gaffer's been great with me the whole time ever, ever since the day the day I broke my leg to, to obviously the day I first went out training. He's he's really been there for me and I really appreciate it. the same with Steve and Dave and Dan and and my family at home. Everything, everyone's been really great. Uh, the lads here have, have been great with me. So I've, you know I've, I've got a lot of thanks to give um, to everybody that's been there for me and 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 I really really appreciate it. I think it's just over seven months to the day since seven the injury itself. Yeah. You mentioned how you feel blessed, but I guess is relief one of the biggest words as well. And um, step back out on that pitch today, without a doubt, yeah, a lot of relief. Um, obviously, like there's times when I'm looking down at my leg and I've got I've got lumps where there shouldn't be lumps, and I've you know I've got my, I've got a photo of my leg open, um, like my bones hanging out my leg, and there's there's times that I think maybe like maybe there's a little bit too much, maybe you know you break your leg if you fear the worst, but. Obviously, like you say, a lot of relief to be back out there, and now hopefully I can I can feel comfortable and get fit again, um, and and see where that takes me.